He's a whistleblower who has brought down 11 officials in Chongqing with a leaked sex tape. Journalist Zhu Rei Feng is now trying to keep himself out of the reach of Chinese investigators. On Monday, accompanied by three lawyers, Zhu met with Chongqing police in Beijing. They searched my home on Sunday, wanted to find out what else I had and who gave the tapes to me. They wanted me to hand over the tapes and to get my source. The saga began last November with a tape Zhu said was handed to him by someone in the Chongqing police force. The tape exposed Lei Zheng Fu, a district-level party secretary who accepted the gift of a prostitute from a construction building owner. Lei was later extorted to grant building contracts to him. Lei was swiftly fired. Last week, Chongqing authorities said another 10 officials linked to the same sex extortion ring were also sacked. Zhu says he has more tapes that incriminate other officials, and that's why police are now going after him. I was monitoring 28 officials. Now it's expanded to 38. The police asked what other information I had and who gave them to me. They want the original copies so they can find who in the Chongqing police force is leaking this information. Zhu has refused to turn in the tapes, saying he needs to protect his sources. As a citizen, Zhu has obtained some evidence against law-breaking officials. It's up to him to decide who to publish the information with. Chongqing police should go through proper procedures rather than going across the country to question or threaten Zhu in Beijing. The sex extortion happened around 2008, when disgraced Chinese official Bo Xilai was the party chief of Chongqing. Bo's police chief, Wang Lijun, reportedly helped to cover up the investigation at the time. Wang Li Jun is now behind bars, and Bo Xilai is facing trial for possible corruption and abuse of power allegations.